Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh to Dr. Azmi bin Hussein and very good to Dr. On John C. My name is Wan Ahmad Arif bin Wan Rusli and my SV is Dr. Hamid bin Yusuf. I want to present my title of final year project which is performance analysis of solar dryer using IoT system. In the introduction for the project background at the Sungai Baru Tengah, Kuala Kura Pari Punta Perak. Fish are dry in the sun in an open environment or traditional generating system. Methods are depend entirely on the weather and sun. Heat absorbed by dried fish will be lost to the surrounding through convection. Conventional methods are less hygiene and open to the surrounding. So come up with the idea to use heat wave from the sun that enter a confined and sealed transparent building, generating house. The transparent structure is created with polycarbonate material that does not allow the heat inside the building to be lost to the surrounding and become excellent heat insulator. System use only natural heat source, sun or wave, sun or heat wave. The implemented an IoT system to control the quality of fish drying. Okay, this is objective to develop an IoT wagging system to monitor drying rate substrate. To monitor and analyze the drain rate substrate surface and work using an IoT wagging system. The third is to compare the parameters between the solar dryer and the red sunlight dryer. Methodology uh, for the formula where heat transfer convection, U is to thermal transmittance coefficient A on the area of the roof, temperature difference, total thermal resistance, external air film resistance, internal air film resistance, thermal conductivity of heat absorber, thickness of heat absorber. This is modern engineering and IT tools that use in this project. Arduino MKR 1010. FC2231 compression load cell to 20 I2C LCD data logger GM1365 and digital scale. This is methodology. Start examining the needs of the experiment. Identify the important variable. Next, design the step on experiment process. And next is using polycarbonate material on solar dryer house and put absorbing material. Uh, silica gel on the first compa compartment. Install the IoT wagging system hardware. Setting the performance analysis of IoT by using wagging system software, and perform the experiment analysis. The result using SIMA plot software add on result, and then go to the perform the experiment until the day six, and go to then go to the discussion and conclusion. This is net drying tray in the first compartment and second is digital wagging scale and data logger placed outside and data logger placed inside silica gel this is corrugated polycarbonate transparent sheet for the home solar dryer and then uh, this is sigma plot uh, used for the analysis data, data. Okay, this is developed an IoT wagging system uh, okay uh, for the this is block diagram of the system and the schematic diagram of the greenhouse integrated with IoT. The main controller for this project was Arduino MKR 1010. It was at some 21 Cortex M032 bits low power arm MCU microprocessor with a clock frequency of up to 32.768 kHz, 48 Hz. Uh, megahertz supported Wi-Fi connectivity with 150 Mbps uh, speed supported with Box Classic Bluetooth V4.2. The sensor used was FC2231 compression load cell for compression load input. The reading capacity of the compression load sensor was in range 0 to 4.6 kg per unit. The 220i2c LCD was used as the display for the units. The TFT display uses graphical methods so the display will limitless compared to the characteristic LCD. The supplies used in this project were SC240 volt, DC212 volt and DC3.3 volt. Okay this is web dashboard uh, for the IoT system. This is wagging scale for IoT system with uh, 1 kg mullet fish. This is main system and the parts name and the power supply unit and the part name. 
and al alarm LED notification system at the part ni. Okay, this is data analysis inside and outside home solar dryer. This is a graph for the experiment. I've contained a fish weight, temperature and relative humidity, starting with a 250 gram both inside and outside for the mullet fish. This is a result for this experiment. Initial weight is for the inside 250 gram and final 196 gram. And for the outside, a starting 250 gram and then 200. 5.3 for the final week. The maximum drying temperature is 56 degrees Celsius for the inside home solar dryer. Maximum moisture loss 21.6%. Uh, maximum moisture removal rates uh, 6.75 gram per hour for the inside. Maximum heat transfer for the inside kilo, uh, 16.1 to 1 kilowatt. This is Final product dry using conventional method on the left side and home solar dryer on the right side. And we can see the on the left side is so dull and not test uh look not testy and the right side is maintained for the color and look yeah tasty. This is data analysis inside home solar dryer between 120 kg and 1 kg. This is graph for the 120 kg and this is graph for 1 kg. This is result for the 120 kg. For the initial weight, uh, we use a 1 kg and for the final weight, 739 gram. For the maximum drain temperature is 51.4 degrees Celsius and the moisture loss for the maximum is 26.10 percent maximum moisture removal removal rates 2.625 gram per hour maximum heat transfer is 10.965 kilowatts and for the next result for the 1 kg initial weight 1 kg and final weight is 698 gram maximum drain temperature 55 degrees Celsius and moisture loss for the maximum 30.20% uh, maximum moisture removal rate is 37.75 gram per hour maximum heat transfer is 17.758 kilowatt this is discussion on temperature and humidity against time show the graph of the temperature and relative humidity of inside the home solar area and ambient where the fish on net drying tray inside were varied from 120 kg 90 kg 60 kg 30 kg and 1 kg the temperature and relative humidity show large difference in the data of inside and outside the fish on the net drying tray for 120 kg and 30 kg were collected at 2 pm and then only half of the 90 kg of fish were collected 2 pm however of these four 60 kg of fish were not collected until 5 pm as the cloudy and rainy weather caused the draining rate on that day to be fluctuated from the graph the maximum temperature was recorded on day 6 with 1 kg of fish and then the inside Temperature was 55 degrees Celsius and the relative humidity was 27.2% RH at 3.03 pm with the ambient temperature of 33.3 degrees Celsius and relative humidity of 66.4% RH. It could be correlated that the re relative humidity dropped when the temperature increased, the home solar dryer used natural force convection, hence it need to collect heat and require a certain amount of time to make the temperature higher but never lower than the ambient temperature and higher from outside relative humidity. The convective heat transfer coefficient strongly depends on the moisture evaporated from the crop surface and the drying area based on the temperature graph each experiment show the maximum heat inside the dryer and 
minimum reality humidity at 3 pm. Okay, the conclusion is IoT working system is successfully developed. Temperature inside the home solar array higher than the corresponding ambient temperature leading to lower relative humidity. Drying rates inside home solar dryer higher compared with conventional method. The high uh, temperature increment and rel relative humidity decrease are strong evidence of the efficiency of the home solar dryer. Highest inside temperature obtained was 55.0 degrees Celsius which uh, increased by 21 0.7 degrees Celsius from the ambient temperature at that time on 1 kg molded fish in solar, home solar dryer and for 120 kg molded fish which uh, 51.4 degrees Celsius which increased 13.4 degrees Celsius highest heat transfer rate which was 17.758 kilowatt on 1 kg molded fish and for 120 kg molded fish was 10.965 kilowatt. The moisture removal rates obtained with the rate of 32.625 gram per hour with 120 kg of mullet fish. The future work and recommendation for the problem first, relative humidity inside the home solar dryer increasing during the rainy days and at night. By the installation, a um, blower for the home solar dryer is recommended to enhance the ventilation of the inside of the dryer. The second is, system only recorded the weight of the fish. For recommendation is install an Arduino temperature sensor that will be sent to the cloud server as the IoT wagon system. Okay, the third is, data connection was an error and led to false data collection. Uh, for the improve the accuracy of the IoT wiki system. Base of the home solar dryer needs improvement to collect heat and release it at night or rainy days. Using four layers for the basement as the first layer comprised cement and sand. The next canvas consisted of median size gravel and then relayed with cement and sand. 